Jack Cunningham is a man beaten down by life, drinking from the time he wakes up in the morning till he passes out at night, hoping to dull the pain of losing his son. Father Edward, who runs the school he attended and played basketball in as a teenager, interrupts this routine and asks him to take over as coach. While initially resistant, he ultimately agrees. Due to their ability and mentality, results early on are poor, and frustrated by the player's attitude on and off the court, Jack makes changes, switching player roles, altering their play style, and appointing a new captain, instilling a competitive attitude in them while communicating in a colorful manner. That's a chicken shit fucking ball! God damn it! I'm working on it. Work harder. When observing Jack's conduct, the team chaplain, Father Mark, Oh, hi, Mark. brings up concerns regarding his choice words. When Jack retorts by asking if God cares about his language, he responds in kind. As Christians, we are called by God to integrate our faith into our daily lives. So yes, Jack, I do think he really gives a shit about the example you set for these young men. He does not stop there, as he goes on to point out in a manner that is friendly to the YouTube copyright system. Don't underestimate the impact you can have on them. This line establishes the journey Jack himself would go through during his time coaching, abstaining from alcohol and focusing on what is best for the team, setting an example through action for the impressionable young men looking to the men around them to form the worldview to live by, teaching them, little things add up, let's do all the little things right, and earning the small victories, stacking them up to win by working hard, yet life overwhelms, causing some to break while others rise to the challenge. The lessons learned and the impact they had on each other are profound, as, by being honest, Jack could walk the path to recovery, while the team would excel, not only as players, but young men stepping out into the world. Whether it be Brandon leading the team, Jack fighting his alcohol dependency, or something as small as putting your house in order, it's like, well, how do you start? Make your bed. By being consistent, Little things add up. Let's do all the little things right. 